hello guys welcome back to another video today's video is gonna be a mukbang with me eating slim chicken i'm eating a um chicken wrap with lettuce and buffalo sauce and pickles and french fries with the lemonade so thank you slim chicken this mukbang is also going to be about me updating you guys about what's going on in my life because I know that other video was kind of crazy, you guys. So I'm just going to give you an update with this video. So let's dive in it. So basically, the last video you guys seen, or probably not the last one you've seen, but with a life update video you guys seen is with uh, me kind of having a breakdown about my marriage and the state of my marriage. Well, I want you guys, this video is gonna be about me telling y'all what is the state of my marriage and what we can look forward to. Also, I remember in that video um, a while back, I told you guys I would be posting more, but because of the circumstances, I wasn't able to post, but now I'm able to post a little bit more, but I'm still gonna be careful about what I say and what I do because I still have stuff going on that I have to get through with me and my family so basically long story short well it's not gonna be a long story short basically me and my family we went through a very crazy time and the end of january i feel like my family dynamic changed forever and i and i want to say it's going to get back to the way it was but it's definitely going to take time and it's going to take work. But I'm willing to do the work. And my husband is willing to do the work. So, I feel like we're going to be okay. And also, I have to talk things over with the children because there was a lot going on. But, we dealt with something very instrumental in our marriage it took us from a loop it surprised the heck out of me i think it forced me and my husband to figure out what we wanted to do and not just keep on going with the flow of things with everyday life taking care of children making sure that everything is okay so that the children will be okay we had to force ourselves to figure out why did we get married in the first place? Do we really love each other? So guys, I wanna bring him in the video too, uh, one of these days, but that's gonna be um, something we talk about. But I, so you guys can get his opinion about things. Also his viewpoint of things. But I just wanna let you know, I'm okay. The family's okay. We're working on our marriage. That's the most important thing. We both want to fight for our marriage. We do not want a divorce. We don't want our children being raised in a single family home, but that's just not why we're getting a divorce. We're, getting, we're not getting a divorce because we do love each other. And we did fall in, uh, fall in love for a reason. Um, we just lost our way, if, you, if that makes sense. And so... I feel like God don't give you nothing that you can't handle. And he put this on us so it, it can wake us up and say, hey, if you don't do something in the next 10 years, or not even 10, if you make it that long, in the next five years or the next six years, things are not going to be like this. Or next two years, next year, things are not going to be good. You guys have to fix it, focus, and figure out what you guys want to do. This is so good, y'all. But I also want to come on here and be some type of mentor if I can, if you guys see me that way. Or just share my story and maybe it will touch somebody who going, maybe going through the same thing I'm going through. So, that's why I'm sharing my story. I'm 
going to be giving you guys more updates because now I can post videos. So I'm going to try to post a video every week, if not more. Um, I know that um, Amir birthday have passed so far. His birthday was in February. We did have a party for him. And I'm going to upload that video too, guys. Because I, I have some stuff that I've been waiting to upload. Mm. Um, if y'all wondering why some of the videos I might post in the next few weeks why they might seem old they are old but I'm gonna be posting more with uh, um, life updates with the Sadar family how's it going because we're going to take things day by day and we just roll with the punches as they come because marriage is not easy guys marriage is not easy and marriage is not like a a boyfriend girlfriend thing like you oh he getting on my nerves so i'm ready to leave no this is like a forever thing where that's how we feel about it this is a forever thing and we're not throwing in a towel we're gonna fight so we're definitely gonna see counseling uh i'm gonna update you guys about that also i'm also gonna see counseling for myself personally i start my counseling next week i want to guys give you guys updates on that too mm -hmm. Oh, it's so good. But because in the in my community, the black community, therapy is sometimes looked upon as a negative thing. And just recently, I feel like the last five years, the community has been like going hard with trying to say hey you need to check on your mental health you know sometimes everything is not okay just because you you keep on going you going you going that don't mean everything is going to be okay sometimes you have to check in with yourself and make sure that you're okay because guess what if you're not okay how the heck are you supposed to take care of your children how are you supposed to run a household how are you supposed to be loving to your husband if you're not okay and so that's why i'm checking on myself um i have a therapy um set and i'm gonna update you guys with that mm. it's gonna be an interesting journey but i'm ready for the challenge i'm ready for whatever gets thrown my way i'm just ready for something mm. new ways to handle my my anger or, Sometimes you just need to check yourself. I am checking myself, so yeah. But guys, don't think I'm not gonna update you guys when all this is said and done, because I am. I'm gonna tell you all the beans. I just being cautious of what I say. Um, first of all, look, I got my whole chicken sandwich got a whole hole in it how that's supposed to work y'all and then first of all y'all slim chicken got a chokehold on me i've been eating slim chicken for the last two weeks oh god This is good. It really is. But what else, y'all? Oh, I'm gonna start a mini series with my husband, y'all. Tell me if y'all want to see. Comment below if you want to see more of Mr. Cigar. Okay? Because. 
He's a busy man, but we're gonna get him. Hey guys, I also want to shout out everybody who ever said a prayer for me and my family because we receive it. Right? I welcome all the prayer. Say all the prayers for me and my family, y'all. We need them. And leave a comment below if you want me to pray for your family because I will. I definitely been showing out. He definitely been. I've been finding my um. I've been trying to find a relation, a better relationship with God, and I saw him on his journey. And I'm just taking it day by day, just trying to learn stuff. And so, but he's been showing out. He really, he's definitely been lo looking over my family, guiding my family, and I'm just thankful. I'm so thankful. Because without him, I don't know where we would be. So, that's what I felt. For anybody who ever said a prayer for me and my family, I know my family been praying for us like crazy. We appreciate it. We receive it. And I thank you. But, y'all, yeah, I'm full. So I think I'm going to call it a wrap on this video. But guys, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Um, I'm definitely going to be um, loading, uploading more videos for you guys. So bear with me because I'm still new to this. So thank you for liking, sharing, and subscribing.